Concord County 911, where is your emergency? Uh, my house. Okay, what's the emergency? Uh, I just killed my mom and my sister. What? I just killed my mom and my sister. You just killed your mother and your sister? How did you do that? Uh, I shot him with a uh, 22 revolver. And what is your name? Jay Devins. Are you sure they're dead? Yes. Okay. I want you to stay on the phone with me, okay? Are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. Hold on just a minute. Where is the gun? Uh, it's on the kitchen counter. Okay. It's a 22? Yes. Okay. Hold on. Jake? Yes? Are you on any kind of medication? No. Well, I, uh, I've been going to the allergist a lot lately. Yeah. My mom. But no, nothing other than that. Okay. You don't take any other kind of medication? I mean, other than like Zyrtec and like Advil and, you know, like Sudafed and stuff like that, you know, for the allergies and headaches. But yeah. no. Okay, do you, um, is there any reason that you were so angry at your mother and your sister? Uh, I don't know. I, uh, I wasn't, it's weird. I wasn't even really angry with them. It just kind of, happened. I've been kind of uh, planning on uh, killing for a while now. The, the two of them or just anybody? Pretty much anybody. Why? I don't know. I, I, I don't really like uh, people's uh, kind of attitude. Right. I think they're kind of, they're very uh, like, you know, emotional, I don't know, verbally rude to each other and stuff like that. Right. I don't know. They're, it's okay. It's just my family, I don't know, they're just kind of really, I, I guess this is really selfish to say, but to me, they, I felt like they were just suffocating me in a way. I don't know. Uh, I, I, I think I'm Obviously, you know, I'm pretty, uh, I guess, evil, but uh, that's, I don't know, whatever. Okay. Sorry. Are, no, don't be sorry. It's all right. I'm listening. Okay, you have my undivided attention. Uh, were your mom and sister in their beds? No. Uh, uh, this, this is really going to mess me up for the you know, in the future, uh, let's see, my sister, I told my sister that my mom needed her. Mm -hmm. She was in her room, and she came out of her room, and uh, I, I shot her, and then I went down and I shot my mom. So they're both downstairs? Uh, yes. Okay, where are you? In the kitchen. Okay. You're not sitting by the gun, are you? No, it's about like uh, 10 or 15 feet away from me. Jake Evans was charged with two counts of capital murder. In Texas, capital murder is the most serious homicide offense, and Jake, just 17 at the time of the killings, faced a possible sentence of life in prison. In 2015, Jake Evans was indeed sentenced to 45 years in prison. The judge stipulated that Jake would have to serve at least half of his sentence before being eligible for parole. The once seemingly ordinary teenager from a quiet suburban neighborhood is now behind bars. His horrific act and the chilling 911 call left a permanent mark on the community and the nation. As we conclude, let us remember the two lives tragically cut short that night. Remember the mother and sister who fell victim to this horrifying act. Their memories live on a stark reminder of the chilling reality that unfolded on that fateful October night in 2012.